Earl Abel um, was a silent film organist and entertainer in the 1920s. With the onset of uh, the talking movie industry, he uh, found himself without anything to do. So he had to make a living some way, and he decided to open up a restaurant in San Antonio. <laughs> He was a great entertainer. He used to tell jokes, make them feel at home, just go from table to table. He developed his menu by traveling all over the United States. He actually had five restaurants open at one time. All their labels. He opened up the Broadway and Hildebrand location in 1940. Uh, when the war started, he couldn't get anybody to work in them. So he ended up having to close all the restaurants but the Broadway, and that became the landmark restaurant. We have two uh, dinner cooks that have been here over 40 years. A server that's been here 42 years. Our managers, one of them has been here over 30 years. Our general manager has been here over 25 years. Baker that's been here 50 years. Uh, pies and cakes, eclairs, cream puffs, uh, cinnamon rolls, Danish. But around Thanksgiving, we sell over 2,000 pies within that week. To him, it's just like another day. My name is Antonio M. Sanchez and I've been working for Earl Abel since December the 4th, 1960. I knew the original Mr. Abel. He wanted perfection all the time, not just, you know, today or tomorrow. He wanted every day, you know. So that's the way I was brought up. My name is Rose Janicek, and I'm the ship manager for Earl Abel's. Everybody loves our fried chicken, and so do I. The fried chicken, obviously, is, uh, is a specialty. Just two weeks ago, we had a special. We had lines around the restaurant. People really enjoy coming here. It takes you back to a, to a different time, to a, to a time where everything was a little bit more relaxed. Uh, I think that's why people keep coming back. Some of our customers eat here two, three times a day. It's extremely rewarding to, to be associated with a business that has been in the city for 78 years. Earl Abels has been a proud member of the Chamber of Commerce since 1933. Being a member of the Chamber is, is vital to, to our growth and uh, to our exposure in the city. Business is very good. Business has been great. That's just the way it is. Yeah.